Considering the fact that I love salmon, and it's kind of been my thing for the past 15 years or so to scour Trader Joe's for new items that need reviewed, you'd think I would have stumbled upon this happy frozen fish dish earlier. It's been around for at least three and a half years, and I'm only now discovering it. Looks like iterations from the past were more like rectangular slabs of salmon, like the ones you might use for grilling. This specimen is more like a big long fish stick. Weird. Impractical. But it's still salmon, so it's still ostensibly delicious. There are three discs of lemon butter frozen to the fish when you get it. The instructions aren't super clear, but I guess you're supposed to put them on the side while you cook the fish skin side up and then drop them on the non-skin side once you flip the fish in the pan. There are anecdotes of heating this fish in the air fryer all over the web, but I wasn't brave enough to try that method this time around. The stovetop method worked great. It took a little longer to get the internal temp of the salmon to 145 degrees than the instructions indicated, but that's no surprise. I added a bit of salt and pepper in addition to the pats of lemon herb butter. The verdict? Near perfection. Lemon and garlic tang cooked into rich, fatty salmon. In fact, the single serving pack has 80% of your daily saturated fat, and it tastes like it too. Sonia and I shared the dish and supplemented with salad and snacks before and after. We would definitely buy Trader Joe's Atlantic Salmon with Lemon Herb Butter again. $5.99 for 7 ounces of yummy farm-raised Norwegian salmon served with a gourmet condiment. Salmon is pretty pricey, so 6 bucks is more than reasonable, especially considering the exceptional flavor and convenience. 8 out of 10 stars from Sonia and me. Really darn good. Thanks for watching. Please let us know what you think of this product in the comments below. Like and subscribe. Have an awesome day. Our souls, the flavorful vibe, it's in the